have a Louis Vuitton key pouch, like the one that everybody has now. Um, and anyway, I bought that years and years ago and I sold it probably like two years ago because I just felt like I grew out of it. Um, like I feel like every young girl has that now. Um, but it was super handy, I'm not gonna lie. Um, so I'm gonna go pick up the Prada one. I've been thinking about it for ages. And um, yeah, it's a bit warm out. I just have this blue lemon jacket on because it's always freezing inside the mall. So I don't want to be cold, but we'll probably just walk around the mall like aimlessly just because it's still hot out here. And yeah, we're not doing anything else. But yeah, I just wanted to update you guys. We just got home and of course I wanted to unbox this for you guys. So here's the bag, cute little ribbon on top. I think I only have one other thing from Prada and it's the sandals that I bought a few years ago. Um, so this is just the receipt. And this is the Safiano, I think it's called the Safiano Key Pouch, but I already forgot. <laughs> um, but here's the box. Hey guys, it's so cute. If you hear that noise, it's Tommy. <laughs> but I love this because it doesn't have to be a key pouch. Like if you have it like this, it just looks like a wallet. Um, but if you open the main compartment, here is the keychain. So if you zip it back up and you have the keychain out, you can put this on your keys and then carry it around like that. But I love that it can be a key pouch or you can hide this and it can just be a wallet. I think that's super, super nice. Um, so here's the main compartment. You have quite a bit of space in there and then you have two card slots and then a little coin pouch on the back and then there's this little pouch on the front. Um, but yeah, it's black with gold details and I think it's so adorable. I think it's such a good size too. Like it'd be handy if you used it as a key pouch, but also if you just want to use it as a wallet um, and not have your keys attached to it. I think it's like the perfect small wallet size. Hi T. <laughs> but yeah, it is so adorable and Peyton at the, um, I like cannot zip it now. Um, Peyton at the Fashion Square Mall helped me. Um, and he was so nice and he made my experience so nice. That was the first time going in the Prada there. I don't like to go in the like designer stores unless I'm going to buy something, which I've never bought anything in person there before. So I've been, well, no, I got my love bracelet there. Um, so I've been inside Cartier and I've been inside Golden Goose, but that's it, because I just feel like so awkward going in these stores if I'm not gonna buy anything. Um, but yeah, he made my experience so nice, and I think this is so cute. And I wanna thank you guys so much for watching my channel. I really, really appreciate it. And I'm so grateful to be able to buy this. Um, but yeah, I think it's adorable. Tommy and I are on our way to meet Jen and Jake at the McCormick Stillman Railroad Park, I think is what it's called. We haven't been there before, but it's basically like a little train park for kids.
Was that Reba? Yeah. How fun. I wanted to show you guys. So the first one was from Amazon. Um, I just got this new Mediterranean book. I thought this would look really good in our bedroom. Um, I just love the cover of this. And then I got Ben a matching phone charger to mine. This like matches the bedroom and the bed and I'll show you guys in a minute. But yeah, I have this one. He got this for me a few months ago. So I just got him one. And then T's Love Every came in today. So it's this pouch with these little bunnies in there. You can like put them in and take them out. And then this, um, like stocking rings and also this like swivels, which is fun. Um, or you can like put them in there. And then this, it's like this box and it has three different lids. And you can either have like these carrots you have to put in there or these that you have to put in there. Um, I'm not really sure about this one. It's okay, baby. <laughs> Here, you want to play with it? Here, you play with that one. And then this Bedtime for Zoe book. This, where you have to put these rings in the circles. Um, this comes with every box. It's like the play guide. So just like info um, on where he's at. So this is the 13, 14, and 15 month box. It's called The Babbler. Um, T just turned one a few weeks ago. So he's almost 13 months. Um, and then this, I've already let him play with this and he absolutely loves it, you guys. So it's like this thing where you put the ball on the top and I'll just show you. It goes down and then there are four different doors. So there's that one and then that you just put your hand through. And then this one you have to lift up. And then this one that you just push in. Um, but yeah, he absolutely loves this and he does it all by himself and it's so good. Um, but yes, yeah, so here's everything. Um, and I think this subscription box comes every three months, but I absolutely love this. If you guys aren't familiar with Love Every, it's like a Montessori subscription box. And yeah, they're just like really good quality toys. So I'm gonna put all these on the floor for T to play with, but I just wanted to show you guys. I absolutely love when this box comes. This was Ben's old phone charger for beside the bed, and here's the new one. Looks so good. And then I've decided to put the new book here on this cabinet. I used to feel so strongly that like the more stuff I had, the more cluttered it felt. Um, but now I feel like the more stuff, like stuff as in home decor, mm -hmm. um, that I accumulate, the like cozier and warmer it feels in here. So I am just always trying to find like little things to add just to make the house feel more warm and inviting. We are headed to dinner now. Um, we're going to North Italia. It's in Carolyn Commons and we've actually never been there before. So I'm really excited to try it out.
So I didn't get much, just the cotton candy grapes and strawberries to go with the coconut fruit dip. And then I picked up a couple more Alani Nails, the peach and the Kim Kardashian one. It's only 85 degrees out, which feels so good. Feels like it's been so hot for so long here, and it's finally getting cooler out. I am in my jammies, but I just got this package delivered from Kite Baby. If I can open it. And T just got out of his bath, so I want to put him in one of these. I ordered him some Halloween outfits. You guys, I'm obsessed with Halloween. It's like my favorite holiday for real. So I got this orange one with pumpkins. So cute. Also, Kite Baby is where I buy most of his clothes because they're just so soft. They're such good quality. So here's this one. So cute. And then I got this black one with little ghosts. If anybody wants the links to these, let me know. How stinking adorable. Oh my goodness. And then last one is this spider web. Do you think you are these? Are you kidding me? Adorable. 